Hi there, welcome to the next video and in this video I will show you the nested um, list comprehension which applies multiple loop. So for example, you have seen that for loop that we had used to create a new list. Now what we will do is we will try to create a new list by forming a nested for loop. So for that what I have is just two list, list one with some numbers, list two with some numbers and if I execute that it will work fine and now let's create the nested loops for creation of a list using list comprehension so list1 underscore list2 just to make it simple and I will say i comma j for i in list1 for again for i sorry j in list 2. Alright, so what we are doing is this is basically going to create uh, the tuple like this. So i and j, i is going into the list 1 first and j is going into the for loop. What you can do is uh, pause this video and try to think what kind of an output that you will going to get with the help of this list uh, comprehension operation. So if I go in and execute that, it's going to work fine list 1 now if I say list 1 and list 2 what you get is for each of the element the first five values are coming over here because uh, the for loop is running for each of the j value and then it is when the value is finished it's again coming into the i now the 37 and then again its value is coming so that's how it is going to repeat one by one and produce a nested for loop for you. So if you have a condition where you need to do a nested for loop, then this is how very easily in just one line you can do it with the help of the list comprehensions.